I'll try and bring you up to date exactly where we are as we know it. And I understand as well, by the way, that Harry himself is watching. He's got good taste. So hello, Harry. And if I'm wrong about any of this, please let me know. Yesterday, we know that uh, Tottenham agreed uh, a deal with Bayern Munich around 85 million with obtainable uh, add-ons getting into the uh, 100 million. So a deal that starts with one, which makes Daniel Levy happy, makes Bayern Munich happy because they'll get their man. Then we heard that Harry Kane still hadn't finally decided that that was the move that he wanted. He was erring towards staying at Tottenham. Then overnight, it was agreed that he was going to go. He does want to go to Bayern Munich. He agreed personal terms, uh, wages of around £21 million a year before tax, around £11 million a year after tax, a four-year deal. Uh, then uh, we heard he was on, a, on his way to uh, an airport, in a car, to get on a plane, to fly to Munich, to have his medical, all that was this morning, to sign on the dotted line and do the media photographs and potentially play in the Super Cup final against uh, Leipzig tomorrow evening. But a fly in the ointment because uh, Daniel Levy, Tottenham Hotspur haven't given formal permission for Harry Kane to get on that plane and to fly to complete the deal. They're looking at apparently a game with a fine tooth comb at the deal, just looking at some of the monies involved. And as we stand at the moment, Harry Kane is ready to fly, got his bags packed, but can't quite fly at the moment until Daniel Levy gives him the say so, gives him the green light. So here we are still with drama after drama in this uh, Harry Kane deal. But it does look, all things being equal, if things can be all equal in this saga, that Harry Kane by the end of today, certainly by tomorrow, will be a, a Bayern Munich player. Gary, I just actually bring you a line that Paul Gilmore has just sent in while, while you've been speaking to us. He said that Tottenham Hotspur have told Sky Sports News that Harry Kane does have permission to travel for his medical and, and to sort out his personal terms. So they say that their agreement with Bayern Munich remains in place. That hasn't changed, but he does have permission. So look, this, this feels like it, it could be completed fairly quickly now. Yeah, so uh, probably there is Harry now uh, switching off Sky Sports News and heading out the door. We understand he was somewhere near the airport he intends to fly from it'll be a private jet of course it's already standing by so see things do seem to be moving pretty quickly one wag suggested to me down here at the training ground that daniel levy may be delaying things slightly so that it means that harry kane couldn't pull on the boots for the super cup game tomorrow and therefore wouldn't win a trophy within a day of leaving Tottenham Hotspur. I'm not sure that's the case, but certainly now it seems that that official permission has been given and Harry Kane is on his way. If he does play tomorrow, tomorrow, great. If he doesn't, then the uh, first game he will be involved in is the Bundesliga opener against Werder Bremen, which is uh, available to watch on Sky Sports. Uh, Harry Kane, who came here as an 11-year-old uh, for the sake of wanting to win trophies and for another 11, 11 million pounds a year uh, after tax has decided to leave Tottenham after a career here, man and boy. Who, how are they going to replace the 30 goals he scored last season, uh, all the goals he scores on a regular basis after season, all the assists as well? Well, that's now the question for Tottenham Hotspur and for Daniel Levy. And of course, there'll be a news conference here looking forward to the Brentford game, which is on Super Sunday later on today. So we'll hear from the coaching staff exactly how they feel about all these latest developments but yeah it looks like this saga finally drawing to a close and next time we see Harry Kane maybe at an airport getting on a plane maybe at an airport getting off a plane or it may be him posing in the red of Bayern Munich.